Hey there guys, this is Nick from Danny's Wine and Beer Supplies and in this video I'll be talking to you about a hydrometer and how it's used. So what a hydrometer is, is it's a glass tool that's used to measure the uh, sugar content and potential alcohol of your wine or your beer. By, uh, by measuring the content of your uh, juice or your wort at the start of fermentation, you can see how much sugar you're starting with. You can then monitor your fermentation and then by taking a reading at the end, you can calculate how much alcohol your, uh, your wine or your beer approximately contains. So to use a hydrometer, it's pretty simple. You just float it in your wine or your beer and see where it floats. Like all equipment though, you're going to need to sanitize it before you start using it. This makes sure that you uh, don't contaminate your sample. You're also gonna need a particular type of container to do this, such as a test tube or a thief. Uh, using a thief is a little bit easier because you can just take the hydrometer, uh, place it in, and then float the thief right into the uh, right into the carboy. You don't have to siphon anything off into a test tube. But for this demonstration, I have a test tube here filled up with water. Uh, so whenever you're using your thief, you want, or whenever you're using your hydrometer, you're going to want to make sure that the the container you have is filled up with enough water or enough uh, of your sample. So about 80% full. And then to use your hydrometer, you're simply going to place it into the sample and give it a gentle spin when you put it in. This will stop uh, bubbles from forming on the bottom of the glass, which will affect your reading. So as you can see, it's floating in there. In general, the higher your hydrometer floats, the, the higher the sugar content, whereas the lower it'll float, the lower the sugar content. And then to take an exact reading, you simply look at the, the measurements on it and see which line the hydrometer is floating on. Most hydrometers, like this one, are calibrated to take, to take measurements at 20 degrees Celsius. So if your wine or your beer is hotter or colder than that, it'll throw off the reading. Uh, usually this can be accounted for with a formula that's going to be printed right onto the hydrometer or it'll be in the instructions that the hydrometer comes with. If you're worried about your hydrometer, you think maybe it's not working properly or you've had trouble using it, uh, an easy way to test it is to just use water at 20 degrees Celsius and it should always float at 1.00. So once again guys, it's been Nick from Danny's Wine and Beer Supplies and if this video has been helpful to you, make sure you check out our website at www.dannyswineandbeer.com.